really flummy to the- Oh my god, I do love my choker. Hey bro. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. I'm actually so ugly and this is actually the most requested video honestly that I get. Like honestly. If you look in my DMs, my direct messages, my literal nude inbox, I get three kinds of messages. Naked pictures from old men that I didn't ask for. I get pictures and videos from my students of them contorting themselves. And three, how my hair looks so good. You know what? I'm here to answer your question. What's your question? Why does my hair look good? The answer is it doesn't, but I'm going to show you how to get my hair. I have really, 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 really long hair. That's not news to anyone. So long. I just put like effort into my washing and drying situation and then I do nothing for like eight days. Like I'm not kidding you. I probably washed my hair either like last Sunday <laughs> or like last Monday. So I'm basically just gonna like take a shower and video it. <laughs> We're gonna get demonetized if I show my nipple. So the first thing I do is I take this brush. Okay, I have had this brush like 12 years. I should really get a new one. Like they're not that expensive. It's called a tangle teaser. Ugh, gorgeous. I don't feel like it's like ripping my hair out. If I use like a regular brush, like I actually feel bald by the end of this. I have really, really, really tangly hair. Like literally one minute goes by and my hair is like this in one big knot. Honestly, if you have extensions or really, really long hair or really tangly hair, do you need this brush? It's kind of mandatory. Honestly, I'll pause right now so you can go to Sephora and get this brush. You're welcome, change your life. First thing I do is I brush through the ends. Oh, you can't even see the ends of my hair because my hair is so long. <laughs> oh my god, are you gonna see my receding hairline today? That's really good. So this is the part where I get naked. Look at my ears. <laughs> Okay, this happens to me a lot. I'll take an inhale and it'll be like, and I'll be like, like a clown trick pulling my own hair out of my mouth. If I take a regular brush and I try to go like this, the brush will stay here and I'll be like, oh. Okay, well, I'm so. <laughs> okay, if you don't have like this kind of shower head, then like you can't wash your hair. How do you wash your hair? I look so ugly. Okay, so now I shampoo. The Living Proof Restore Shampoo reverses dryness and damage for visibly healthier hair. My butt is so itchy. I'm almost out right now, so I need to go to Sephora. But what I do is I double shampoo my hair because, you know, when you don't wash it for eight days, when I don't have that, I use the L'Oreal Total Repair Shampoo. It's a split end repair. And let me tell you, these ends are split. Like, they're split. Like, they're like, split. Yeah. Uh, the thing is that this isn't gonna like foam up a lot. It normally does, but I have so much grease in my hair right now and like dirt from not washing it. I'm gonna wait like three minutes and then I'm gonna rinse it out. And then after those three minutes, my hair will be like really like what's that called? So I like to pick a song so that I can time out how long I leave things in my hair. That was kind of good, like I kind of did that. Now I'm gonna wash it out. The living proof. Uh, oh, it smells so good. You just pretend like the first rinse didn't even happen and my hair was like this clean the whole time. So see how she's like foamy foam now? I like to leave everything in for like two minutes. Well, the conditioner I leave it for like a hundred years. That gets so itchy. The next thing I do is condition my hair. We have the living proof restore conditioner. And I'm almost out of this. So luckily, ah! It's time to rinse this out. Honestly, I'm pretty lucky. I don't think I've ever gotten like shampoo or conditioner like in my eye. But I do remember that kids L'Oreal shampoo, I think it was L'Oreal, that like the shampoo that like, it was like no burn, like won't burn your eyes. And you'd get it in your eyes because you're like, well, it's fine, I can. And you would literally burn your retina off. It's time to condition. I like to get all the water out of my hair. So I go like this. With great. Time to open 
the new one. <laughs> can't really see that, but I'm going into the end. <laughs> Trying to untangle it with my hands, slowly ripping out every piece of hair that I have to the point where I'm bald. People tell you you're not supposed to condition your scalp, but I'm confused. Because if I don't, my floor is soaking wet. If I don't condition my scalp, then like, I'm going to brush through my hair with my conditioner. They also say never brush through wet hair. But you know what I do? I brush through wet hair. Look how easy this brushes through. One, because the conditioner is amazing, and two, because this brush is so good. So this has to sit for like four whole minutes. Honestly, filming this is kind of like helpful because I can see how much time has passed. Should I film all of my showers? That kind of sounds like a porno, never mind. <laughs> you don't water in my nose. <laughs> Another conditioner that I love, Garnier Whole Blend Replenishing Conditioner. Honestly, this is a literally life-changing. It's so thick. <laughs> Your hair feels like thick after you wash it. This conditioner literally smells unbelievable. It just smells like $38. That's what it smells like. Okay, so honestly, that's all I do. I do a really, really light rinse, nothing crazy. My floor is literally soaking wet. There's literally water everywhere. When people say that they don't get hair like in their butt crack, after washing their hair, like, you're a liar. You're lying. You're a literal liar. So I have to wash the conditioner off of my body now, because, like, all the shampoo conditioner has been running down me. Oh my god, I didn't even wash my body. Ugh. I showered literally last night. Don't judge me. It's literally the morning after. I'm not going anywhere today. Like, literally relax. Don't, like, stop. Stop. You're being rude. Stop. Done washing my hair. Look how big my traps look. I'm so sore. So I have a specific towel that I dry my hair with and a specific towel for my body. Is that high maintenance? Yeah. Do I care? No. So I go, ugh. And I take my towel. <sighs> okay, so now my hair. <sighs> so now my hair's up. So this is the towel that I use to wash my body. Honestly, this towel, <sighs> you've never felt a softer towel. Do you think you have? Because you haven't. I've literally never felt anything this soft except for like Steve when he was a puppy. <gasps> Would it be bad if someone had like a puppy hair towel? That's abuse. PETA stop 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 stop. PETA stop. I'm not gonna kill a dog and make it into a towel. Okay? Relax. Relax. Maybe like a chinchilla, but that, uh, that's as far as I'll go. It's as far as I'll go. I leave my hair up for like 10 minutes, okay? And this thing with my 10 minutes is up now. I like did my whole skincare and like I'm ready to go, okay? This lighting, terrible. I'm aware. So... Okay, I got this shirt from Winners. <laughs> Ow! If you don't use a leave-in conditioner, your hair's dry, and it's like... I just thought about the time that, like, Lakin roasted me calling my hair dry. Leave-in conditioner is, like, slept on. You need a leave-in conditioner. You if you don't use a leave-in conditioner, your, your hair's, hair's dry. <laughs> but your hair is dry. <laughs> just rip my wig off, it's fine. <laughs> so this is the leave-in living proof repair. And honestly, I've been using this for, I don't know, a long time. Everybody I put on this leave-in conditioner is like, Thank you, holy grail, holy hell, I need this in my life. My friend put me on this. Thank you, Shakira, because you've changed my life. Now, this says, apply one to two pumps onto damp hair. I put two pumps on this side, two pumps on this side, and two pumps on the top. So I use about six. I also have like 33 inch hair, okay? Almost probably 34 now. I have so many inches. This is like feet now. Like, I have like feet. So I have to use a lot. Do I have to really use a lot? No, but do I? Yeah. So, oh, and this smell is again, like, so good. What is this? What is going on here? It looks like I have a hickey and like, what am I, 12? That's the hair tutorial. Thank you for coming. Let me put this up here so this can dry. I don't have a towel rack. Why don't I have a towel rack? Because we're on a budget. Lol, I keep saying I'm on a budget, but like, I spend about $100 on my hair routine. Oh, way more than $100. We'll get there. Oh, yes. <sighs> Can you see? You can't see, but I'm doing this. <sighs> Look at this, okay? Okay, it looks like 
literal Dora, I look so short. So now I have to brush it. And I just middle part it. I don't like to be exact with my middle parts because I feel like if you're like exact exact, okay, if you have straight hair, you should have an exact middle part. Do you know what I mean? If you don't have straight hair, your middle part should be a little drunk. It should be like a tequila shot or two in. You know what I mean? Not like three where it's like literal zigzags. So now that my hair is like brushed, it just makes it easier to put this now one, two into the ends of my hair. Then I brush through this side. We do a lot of brushing on this channel. I use the Tatcha Gold Camellia Beauty Oil. As you can see, I'm pretty much almost done it. Boom! We'll do a little unboxing. Okay, so, ow! Oh my god, I think I just got a paper cut, a cardboard cut. Oh my god, I did. Ow, oh, Steve, that really hurt. Oh, that tasted like leaving conditioner. Oh my god, can you see the gold flakes? Look at them floating around in there being like, I'm gold. One pump. Uh, this is gorgeous. This is literally gorgina. So I put the leave-in conditioner in my hair, okay? And then I feel like this really just like seals it in. It makes it so silky and soft. One, two, three, four, five. And then I go mix, 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 warm her up. And then I put her all in the ends. Oh my god, the smell of this oil is literally like, if I could have this in like a room spray, Tatcha, you need to make like a room spray. If they made like a room spray, then like I would buy this room spray. So now we're gonna do the other side. Oh my god, my thumb, I swear to god, I'm gonna like call 911. <gasps> I just feel so cute now. Long hair, you don't have that? Can't relate. Oh, Jeffrey, don't sue me. Please don't sue me. Please don't sue me. Please don't sue me. Yeah, anyway, I've had this oil now for like a year and a half. All right, so now the very last step, and this is very important, okay? I brush it like this, and then I brush it straight. I take my scrunchie and two hair clips. I'm gonna put it into a low bun. I'm not like super like make it crazy 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 neat because I don't want my hair to look like I did it. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> now I look like a waiter. I look like the wait staff. I look like I'm gonna like serve you a drink and I have to leave this in like this for three hours. I know that is so specific and you're like, Nicholas, relax, it's not that deep. It is that deep. This will dry slick down and then this part will be like wavy wave. So see you in three hours. I'm gonna take my hair out now for the next step. So we're not done yet, like we're not done yet. Hair clips, out. So now it looks like this. So my hair's still a little wet. Where we're at now in the process is I have these like loose waves going on. Like a loose wave. Like, do you know what I mean? Like my hair is like in a loose wave. So I just pull this back and I put this in a ponytail now. So now this part can dry. Oh my God, it's literally so soft, I can puke. Like if you're not doing the things that I'm doing to your hair, what? If you're not doing the things that I'm doing to my hair to get this hair, like your hair is not soft. So I'll see you in about an hour. Okay, so I just took it out. Okay, I'm gonna be honest. Like I fell asleep. Oh. So my hair's pretty much dry now. It's like a hair damp, like like a little a hair. It's like a little bit damp, like right in the back. So, um, yeah, this is what my hair looks like. <laughs> I think we should do like a montage of like my hair being cute. You know what I mean? Oh, you can't even see my hair. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'm screaming, thanks for watching. Um, it's been a gorgeous time. Everybody should grow their hair. Honestly, I really feel it. Like when people are like, I'm gonna cut my hair to my shoulders. I'm like, for what though? I will link the products that I use in my hair in the description that help me achieve this look. Do you know what I mean? This like, this vibe. <laughs> Subscribe, you're already here. That would be helpful. 
click the button that says red is this rag. Like this video, give it a pity like. There's not really anything to like, you know, pity, like I look kind of good. <laughs> Instagram is at actually so ugly. I look better there. I mean, actually I look kind of good right now, so. So I don't know. The thing about long hair is like, everyone's like, isn't it so much to maintain? And I'm like, honestly, it's not. Like I just put it in a ponytail and like call it a day. The worst part though is that like, I have to put it up when I poo because it's so long now that it'll like sit on the on the toilet seat and like I don't need to get like poo in my hair, right? It falls in the dishwasher if I'm putting dishes in. Sometimes if I get in my car too fast, I like, I'll like shut it in the door and I'm like Arr. 